Hi Gemini, <clears throat> all placements. Welcome to the channel. T Infinity here back again with another message. Happy full moon day. Happy full moon day, everybody. I hope all is well, safe, healthy, and enjoying their full moon day. Okay, so this is a general message, Gemini, all placements. We're just going to be taking a look into the energy to see what Most High has for you concerning anything that Most High may need for you to know. Okay, money, family, children, um, work, secrets, signs, anything that Most High or the Archangels have for you. This message is for you. If you're new, thank you for being here, Gemini. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell so you can be alerted when I upload new videos. And don't forget to comment below for the 2020 giveaway. February 2022 giveaway. Without further ado, let's get into this message for you. Okay, air signs, Gemini. This is for the Gemini or placement. I was getting a channel message for you when I first started sparking this sage. Okay, the message that I was getting from you was somebody is around you that has a hidden agenda. You probably not know. You probably don't know about this because you probably would not expect this to be who has a hidden agenda. But this person is very low by vibrating. Okay, and this person is somebody that, like I said, you would least expect. Okay, so don't forget to hit that bell. Like I said, let me spark this candle from my Gemini's. All right, and let's go ahead and hop into your message. Okay, sorry for my sniffles, y'all. Air signs, let's start from right here. See, this is what I got before I even started y'all video. Air signs, let's see what most I has for y'all today. Disorder. 2.22, 1 o'clock as I cut this day. So, Gemini's, either you have a disorder or somebody around you has a disorder. This person is a fool. They lack good judgment. You are around a fool, okay? And this is a person that you know, and this is a person that you would at least expect to be a fool. This person has disorders. This person has a chemically imbalance. They could drink a lot. This person could do pills. This person could smoke a lot of weed or smoke a lot of cigarettes or a lot of tobacco. That's what I'm hearing here because if you look at both of these, look at the eyes the eyes it's something about this person eyes they can't see or they are um this could be you air sign gemini but i don't think this is you i think this is somebody that you're around that's low vibing like i said most i give us a okay yeah something happened on tuesday that was yesterday somebody wants to know who are you who are you a gemini somebody want to know who you are this could be a water sign does somebody want to know who you are? Okay, let's see. Something happened on Tuesday. On a Tuesday. That was yesterday. All right. Today is Wednesday, the 16th, 2022, the full moon day. Remember? All right. Uh, what you wish will come true. That's what I'm seeing here for my, air, for my Gemini. If love goes too far, it turns into cruelty. Okay, so you broken hearted over somebody that has a disorder that is a fool and that takes love too far okay i'm seeing i am that i am somebody is telling you that i am that i am okay uh air sign gemini the darkest nights produce the brightest stars okay so we're going to see what's going on with that lunar eclipse there's something going on with the lunar eclipse it's giving me full moon vibes okay and God believes in you, so you believe in you. So let's go ahead and get into these messages. We're not going to take all these messages, but we are going to take who are you. We are going to take it's love, if love goes too far, it turns into cruelty. Your dearest wishes coming true. 
and the lunar eclipse. We're going to take that. But this is a message from Most High. I want you to say this. I am that I am. Okay. And God believes in you and you believe in you. And just know the darkest nights produce the brightest stars for all my Geminis that's going through a tough time right now. Okay. The darkest nights produce the brightest stars. And look what energy I cut it on y'all. Full moon. So this is definitely the energy that we're in. Okay, Gemini, thank y'all so much for being here. Hit that thumbs up. Hit that thumbs up, y'all. So let's see what else do most I have for you. So this is what I was talking about, the hidden agenda, Gemini. Somebody has a hidden agenda when it comes to you. I feel like they're non-committal. Okay, and um, I feel like you know this now. They could be a narcissist. They could be a narcissist. Most high, give us um, um, a message for the Geminis from this deck, please. For the full moon. Thank you. This was a lot. So we're not going to take all these, but I'll just show you them. Okay, we're just going to take the ones that was on the top. Games. This the one. Somebody's playing games. And this is the same color as the hidden agenda uh, card that I just showed you, right? Exactly. So there's somebody here that's playing games with you. Okay, Gemini, this person is a fool. They have a disorder. There's something not right in their mind. Okay, when they communicate with you, I feel like this person is all over the place. Okay, Gemini, this person looks at you as a gold digger. All right, this person looks at you as a gold digger. This person that has a hidden agenda, disorder, this fool, this person that plays a lot of games. Gemini, look at the energy coming out, baby. Look at your energy coming out, baby. You invested in this person. You invested in this person, Gemini, didn't you? I know you did. It's okay, though, because remember, what you put out is what you're going to get back. So don't even worry about it. You invested in this person. It's okay. But they play a lot of games. And that's why Most High is wanting me to tell you this today. All right? This is a complicated Scorpio for some of you. This is a complicated situation, period. This this situation could be coming to an end, a uh, Gemini dealing with this energy, okay? Because they say one thing and do another. And didn't I just tell y'all that? Didn't I just tell y'all this person is a fool? This person is a fool. They have a disorder. You should not believe what this person said. This person be lying to you, Gemini. Real talk, because they're interested in a mesmerizing, feminine, sexy body, Leo, okay? A Leo. It could be interested in somebody, too, that has this color kind of hair, Gemini, or this could be you. Take it with how it resonates, okay? But we getting ready to get into this energy. Also, I thank you so much for these beautiful messages from my Gemini's or placement. Please use these uh, tarot cards to clarify each and every one of these oracle cards that you be showing us today. Our angels from all four corners, please come in to this message and protect us as we channel Gemini all placements energy for this full moon and moving forward. Ashe, ashe, ashe. Okay, y'all, let's see what's up. Look what's at the bottom of the deck, y'all. The moon card. Isn't this the energy? So, Gemini, you dealing with a very dark person that's in their emotions, okay? This person is very dark. They're a fool. They have disorders, like I'm saying. This is disorders. When you see the moon card, this card speaks of disorders. This card speaks of illusions, deceit, lies, fears. This also speaks of dreams. So, you could have been... Um, you could have been having some weird dreams lately, Gemini. Okay, this person is why. This is the person that's why. That is why you having these dreams. Okay, come this full moon, because you know they breadcrumbing you. Because you know they breadcrumbing you, Gemini. All right, let's take this full. Let's take this moon energy out, because it matches right with that full moon energy. All right, what is this popping out for y'all? Ace of Wands. So this is this gives me even more spell work energy. All right. This gives me even more spell work energy. Yeah. Gemini, either you was doing spell work on somebody to bind them, eight of swords, or somebody was doing spell work to bind you. Okay. I feel like this was somebody that was juggling you, Gemini. Because this is your energy right here. And look, this is somebody that was juggling you. 
for somebody else. Okay, a new opportunity. The masculine. The masculine. And they jug juggling you for money and they want to invest in somebody else. Okay? They do. It look like a water sign here. Is this a water sign, y'all? Yes, it is. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Mm -hmm. This person wants to come towards this person. Look, with their wand. This 10, 10 on the clock. I think I'm playing, Gemini. Yeah, this masculine. You see, he got the wand right here, right? But you indecisive, and it's, this masculine knows you indecisive, okay? And they know that you probably want to cut them off. 1023 on this clock because they want to go towards another feminine. They want to go towards another feminine, okay? One that's successful and victorious. And remember I told you that you could be dealing with a narcissist? Yeah, this is giving me narcissist vibes here with this six of wands and this emperor, okay? Very much narcissist vibes. And with this too, look at his fist, Gemini. This could be an Aries, Leo, Sad. But but this person, they don't they don't care for you. They don't, this person, you annoy the hell out of them. That's what I'm saying here. But they just keep you around because they want to juggle you and make somebody else jealous and use you for money. Two of Pentacles, two of Swords. All right, Gemini. Yeah, look, they want they, they 11, 11 on the clock. They want they significant other for real, for real, Gemini. But they just on your energy so that you can continue to do for them. Okay, because they playing games with you. They playing games, Gemini. They playing games because you an investor. Because you an investor. And this person straight up living a, a double life. 1133 on this clock, Gemini. So this is what most I want you to know. This is what most I want you to be aware of this full moon. Okay? So let's see here. What else is going on for the Geminis? Why you show us this mesmerized uh, feminine body for the uh, Geminis? Yeah, because look, seven of cups. I feel like you no longer want to be kept as an option, but you are 12, 12 on this clock. 12, number 12. You mean kept as an option, Gemini, okay? You don't want to be kept as an option, but you are. And you know that. And that's why you stand up here hurt. And you could be checking out people's, um, checking out people's, um, channels pages or um any type of information online so you can get some type of information about this person that uh you deal with that's looking to invest in somebody else other than you they divine feminine i already showed y'all the emperor this is the empress and this is you gemini okay this is you feeling stressed out because this person is wanting to separate from you to go towards they happiness ten of cups okay look what i'm saying i ain't making this up ten of swords ten of cups gemini this is you and this is the pisces cancer scorpio that this person wants to go towards that you watch that you be watching gemini okay because you left out in the cold gemini and in a third party situation okay and it, from from some um pisces cancer scorpio that has a child a baby girl that's what i'm hearing here okay and they're waiting on this person from their past gemini this single and abundant person okay and you know that and you're watching this situation you watching this situation closely and very closely even watching this person crafting this is the part somebody that make videos that's what i'm hearing here and that you in regretful a regret about and that did you know that this a uh, water sign is in regret about. That's what I'm hearing here. So that's why you watching this person. Because you don't want this masculine to be waiting on this person. Gemini. And this is the same person that's playing games with you. The same person. Because they want this person. All right. That's why they're lying to you here with the moon card. And I feel like this is making you very angry and upset. Most I said you will get what you, your wishes will come true. Okay. See, Ace of Pentacles. You're going to be stable, 14, 14 on this clock. And you're going to be stable when it comes to this person that's juggling you. So don't even worry about it. Your wishes are going to come true. If you wish to have a baby, you're going to have a baby. If you wish to be stable, you will be stable. If you wish to have a new career, Most High is going to grant you a new career. If you wish to um, have a new job, Most High is going to grant you a new job. That's what Most High is saying. Your wishes will come true. Okay, so why it shows the lunar eclipse for the Gemini? 
Okay, because this lunar eclipse, what is this? You feeling wounded. You feeling wounded, number nine, Gemini. Okay, because you getting juggled, like I said. So you feeling wounded over this situation. You really don't want to deal with this person. You tired of this person playing games with you. That's the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. You using your logic now. Okay, and I feel like you watching something again. A high priestess, divine feminine. Okay, because you know that this person wants to take a leap of faith towards this person. The fool, remember I showed you 1515 15 on this clock. And end it with... With you okay and go towards their healing their healing and gemini i feel like you want to end this with this person as well and go towards your healing okay that's what i'm hearing here this full moon that's what i'm seeing here this full moon you don't want to deal with this person that's constantly juggling you okay because they want to have sex with their divine feminine okay why are you sure is this say one thing and do another Say one thing and do another for the Gemini. Ten of Pentacles. Because this person says that they want to be with you, but they really don't. 1555. They want to be with this Capricorn Taurus of Virgo. This person that they had this baby with. You see this baby again, right? Yeah, this person that they have a spiritual bond with and they have children with. This is the person that they want to be with. The person that crafts all the time. Eight of Pentacles. They want to work. This, they want to work it out with this person. A Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini. That's what I'm seeing here. Isn't this your energy, Gemini? Yes, it is. Because they love this person. And I feel like you know that. And they say one thing and do another. Yeah, because this is this person's twin flame. Love is with the four of wands. This is this person's twin flame. And I feel like you could be blocked. You could be blocked. Yeah. You could be blocked from this person because this person is um, protected by earth angels. That's what I'm hearing here. And Gemini, you being protected so you can get justice and have a new opportunity in love. Okay? So you can have a new opportunity in love. Could be with a Leo. And then I tell you that. This person was an earth angel. Yes. And whoever was playing games is going to get judgment. It's going to get judgment. Think I'm playing. They're going to get cast right into hell. Poverty. And I hope this is not true, Gemini. Okay. But this is the person that say one thing and do another to you. All right. And let's see what else. Why is this complicated here? Complicated Scorpio. Because you moving away from this complicated ass situation. Dealing with, um, I, I feel like, two feminines. Um, for some of my Geminis, because this is definitely your energy and somebody that's breadcrumbing you. All right. You moving away from this person. Yeah. Because this person wants you to wait on them or this person is waiting on somebody else. Gemini, I feel like that. And that's why you watching them. That's why you watching them. It's because, you know, this person is waiting on another person. OK, you know it. They waiting on a single abundant person that I feel like turned they back on them. And I feel like now this making you upset. All right, you hate the fact, two fives right here, that this person does not want to let this person go. And that's what's making shit complicated for you. All right, and why he shows this gold digger? Y'all hear that bird? Come on now, that's confirmation. Gold digger for the Gemini. Told y'all, confirmation. This person know that all you want is money, or they think that all you want is money, Gemini. They do, they do. But Most High is telling you, this person only want money from you. This person only want money from you, Gemini. Point blank, period, poo. That's all they want. They want money from you. They're a gold digger. See? And you know this now. You know this now. And you have a new perspective about the situation. And I feel like this person that wants to go back that you deal with to their old person, this person knows that this person is a gold digger and they money hungry and they don't want to deal with them at all. This could be a Pisces. But they do. They want a new opportunity with this person because they feel like this person is successful and abundant Gemini trying to tell you. Okay, so let's see here. Why you show us this? Who are you for Gemini's? Why did you show us this? Who are you for the Gemini's? Because you want to know why do this person that you love and want to be with still want to be with somebody from their past? Two of Cups. I already showed y'all this, right? I showed you the lovers and the twin flame. This is soulmate energy. And then I just show you that King of Wands. Think I'm playing. Think I'm playing. And you feel burdened because of this. Because you know this is about to be divine intervention when it comes to this. Gemini. 
This is about to be divine intervention when it comes to this. Because this is somebody that want their divine counterpart that you deal with, okay? And they want to know, who are you? They looking at you like you ain't really nobody, Gemini. For real. They looking at you like you nobody. You They looking at you like you the fool. And I already showed you this at the beginning. So why you show us this? If love, if love goes too far... It turns into cruelty. Why you show us this, Most High, for the Gemini's? Because this person is doing magic on you, Gemini. This is your energy with the magician here coming out with the Cancer 2022 on his clock. This person that you think love you is very cruel, okay? This is a Cancer, Gemini. They doing magic on you, or you and this Cancer is doing magic. Okay, yeah, because they want to get back their soulmate twin flame uh, relationship. They want this back. They want this back because they think this person is sexy. I already told you that. And y'all arguing and fighting because of that. Because this person does not want to let this person go. Four of Pentacles. Okay. Think I'm playing. Again, cut it on this. They made an unwise decision, Gemini, and you did too. You made an unwise decision, and I feel like now you feel a type of way, want to argue, fuss and fight, and, you know, um, do uh, magic and change somebody's destiny, or somebody wants to do this to you, but I feel like this is you, Gemini. Yeah, 2121 21 on this clock, and you're going to get karma, if that is true. Trying to be sneaky. See what I'm saying? Gemini, I don't have no problem with you. Y'all know I lay out of death. This is the energy that's coming out for y'all. This is the energy that's coming out for y'all, okay? Look, nine of swords. Because of some childish person trying to manipulate people. Feel it. Yours, Gemini. Yours. So we getting ready to see. Now, I, I don't even know where it went now. That seven of swords came out. You already know. That was somebody that's being sneaky towards you for money, uh, Gemini, like I said. But you have a new perspective. You have a new perspective. This person really does not love you, okay? They're cruel. This is a Cancer or a Virgo for you, Gemini, okay? Now, uh, last but not least, let's go ahead and get this disorder. We're going to get this disorder because remember I keep saying this? What is the disorder for the Geminis? Somebody that's sneaky, seven of swords, and this is exactly the card I was looking for, 22-22 on this clock. Somebody is very sneaky, that, that is in poverty, okay? This person is very sneaky. This is this person right here. This is how I got the deck. I just pulled it out. This is the person that's doing magic on you. That's the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. King of swords. So there you have it. That's the person with the disorder, okay? Because they want to come back to their high priestess. 22 44 on the clock but this person has been put to end this person has been put to the end been put to death okay this whole situation and they got a disorder gemini just so you know okay yes they do this is this person this person that is sneaky y'all my door just opened on its own this person they sneaky okay they lie and they cheat they in poverty they left out in the cold they want you left out in the cold with them okay y'all could be sleeping in the car but this is giving me cancer vibes straight up okay and most i said yes that's the truth these this person is doing magic on you so before we get up out of here we gonna clarify this moon we gonna use a gypsy deck for the moon card most i why you show us the moon card yeah, because you secretly waiting on this person that's not going to do nothing but make you sad, sorrow, sorrow over what? Money, Gemini. If you, I hope you like this message. Look at this. Cherubim. This is somebody, this is the um, angel of love. This is, this could have been taking place since Valentine's Day. That's what I'm hearing here. Okay, because yeah, this person looks at you as a foe. But Gemini, you look at this person because you really love them. Look at this. But they want to reunite with their significant other. And they're false to you. Point blank, period. And that's what most I want you to know with this full moon. So like, share, and subscribe. Let's get a full moon message before we go for the Gemini. Most I get a Gemini is the most important message they need for this full moon. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that thumbs up, y'all. Show the world the real you, full moon in Aquarius. And isn't that this full moon? It sure is. Nothing will come from this situation. Void of course moon. 
Confirmation. Peace.